Hey everyone, and welcome back to day two of our event, which is the Awakening Organization Valorant Tournament. So after a hard fought battle between 48 teams yesterday, we have come up with eight finalists for this team. Uh, it's actually eight quarter finalists. And let me just show the bracket for today. So here are the eight finalists we have for today. At first, we have Team Vanity versus Roblox Champion, which Team Vanity has proven to be very strong is in, the, uh, in yesterday's match as they have won three matches and they made it into the quarterfinals with ease, I would say. And next, we have Monyet versus I Love, which I'm anticipating too because Monyet, we have never seen them play for yesterday's match as one of their opponents has been disqualified as they, are, they didn't show up in time. Next, we have Anybro versus Upper Star Academy. I heard like Anybro is a very uh, highly anticipated team. So we'll look forward to their performance in this uh, in today's matches. As their performance is quite strong in yesterday as well. They only had a hard fought battle against AWA. Others are quite one sided, I would say. And last but not least, we have our confirmed lose versus Thirst Esport which Turs Esport, I heard, is also highly anticipated. So let's see how things will pan out for them. So next, I would like to talk about our giveaway. So we are actually will be, hold, uh, we'll be holding a lucky draw session right after the finals. So after the finals, we'll be hosting the lucky draw event for a 50 ringgit. So if you want to participate in that event, you can just go to the link that I'll be sharing right now to enter the giveaway. So for the give to be eligible for the giveaway, you need to like, share, and comment, and follow us in the post, and then you'll be eligible for the giveaway. And another big thing is we'll be announcing uh, the giveaway after the final has ended. So that means you will, be, you will need to stay until the very end, until we announce the winner. So if the winner, if the announced winner has not been uh, has not been present in the uh, viewers, then we will move on to another winners. So how do we determine if they are watching it live right now? After we have announced the winner, you will need you will have two minutes exactly two minutes to message our Instagram. If you do not, if you fail to do that, we will move on and pick another winner after that. So basically, uh. We just want to reward the viewers that watch uh, the whole tournament until the very end, supporting all of their favorite teams and whatnot. So, and that's all for uh, my part. And I will share the link right now. So, Lufan, who do you think will win for today? I think um, Team Vanity will win this tournament. Um, yeah. they got a lot of fans and you know they, they've been talking that uh, they've been winning previous tournaments I think they even um, uh, participated in a previous tournament that I was playing in and I think they got in the first uh, first three top three in the tournament so you know I think I have high hopes for uh, Team Verity ah I see yeah I heard that any bro has a very huge supporting team as well do you think they had a chance? Yeah. Um, I think they have a chance, but if I were to rank who would win in this tournament, it would probably be Team Vanity, Thirst Esport, and then Any Bro. But who knows? Team Anything Vanity. can happen, right? Yeah, I see. That's nice. So for any of you that are not for any of you that uh fail to catch who is in the quarter finalist, you may look to the bottom right hand side on your screen. We have there which is Team Vanity against Roblox Champion, Monyet versus I Love, Confirm Lose versus Thirst Esport, and Anybro versus Upper Star Academy. So these are the last eight matches that we have, our last eight contestants that we have for the day. And we'll be moving on to one of the matches very soon as they are preparing to start in any time now. So for all of the viewers watching, you can participate in our free giveaway a uh, lucky draw where you'll be entitled to win a 50 ringgit cash prize for free. You can uh, go to our link and find out how to uh, participate in the giveaway. 
So the link is in YouTube and in Facebook as well. So without further ado, let's hop into one of the stream. And apparently in this match, the map is split again. Yeah, it's a, <laughs> it's the yeah. worst map, is it? Yeah. Was that was that someone in game? I think so. Yeah. Okay. Uh, as you guys can see, if you guys Select don't remember which agent. teams are participating. In the uh, bottom right, you can see um, stream one, stream two, stream three, and stream four, um, which teams are competing. But we can also say when when we're uh, selecting which stream. Yep. So this stream is uh, by Any Bro versus Upper Star Academy. So uh, this is uh, the one attacking is. Upper Star Academy, if I'm not wrong. And I think apparently, they don't have a soul. I think it's any bro. Any bro attacking. is attacking. Yep. Any bro is attacking. Oh. Yeah, they don't have a soul. So I don't know how they're going to get info. Um, Let's see, interesting strategy. Sky, they could, this could sky, they could enter with Sky with the dog, but it's going to be hard to enter. But uh, there's nothing interesting so far that's happening since it's the first awesome. time by face. Everyone is just trying to figure out where to play and uh, how they're gonna play their uh, positions. So uh, let's let's head to uh, to another uh, stream. This is confirmed lose versus thirst esport with confirmed lose attacking. Um, they're playing in Haven. If I'm not wrong. Suppressed. Oh, this is Haven. Oh wait, what is this? Is this split? Um, actually, I actually get actually get mixed up with the map still. Yeah, yeah, I've been playing this game since like the first time it came out, and I still get mixed up between split and split. Yeah. Last the woman is playing aggro and he just pushed the uh, grass but uh, they managed to lose that, that round i think uh, i think omen got a little bit too uh, aggressive um I, I think he could have just picked a kill and then went back but uh it seems like like his actions uh motivated his teammates to push with him but it's all right it's pistol round it doesn't matter that much so Shout out to uh, Faris's uh, stream. This is uh, Monyak versus I Love. I love. Uh, yeah. Monyak is attacking. We do hope it's going to be close games for all of them because um, we've managed to narrow down the skill gaps, you know, in the elimination yeah. rounds. Um, but since the matches are conducted, uh, via best of one um maybe there might still be a, a skill gap but we'll see yep agreed so it seems like i love is defending and yep. this is actually the very first time we saw monet play so let's see how to do it not looking good for first round. i think i think they were in the um were they in the non-broadcasted teams? Uh, they are in the broadcasted team, but their opponents are uh, just automatically disqualified because they didn't show up in oh, time. True. Yep. So that's why we didn't see Monet playing for the third round in yesterday's stream. Taking 
Enemy sentry. Recalling my bot. Place an alarm bot. Yeah, let's take a look at this. Turret out. Stop that. This is uh, the same, the same match, but uh, POV. This is uh, POV of I love uh, team, team I love. No more. They met, uh, team Monyak managed to get onto site, but uh, the Sova eradicated them from the uh, site. And now it's a 2v1. Uh, let's see Last if Reyna can clutch it. It seems like Reyna is trying to 1v1. Uh, to check back both sides. And both oh. ours, uh, Sova fails to get the last kill. And uh, Reyna uh, gets, uh, gets the round for themselves. Let's like, take a look at Team Vanity against Robot Champion, shall we? They're all playing Sheriffs, as you can see, and Jet is getting them one tap through the wall. But I would not be surprised if she can do that, as she has been displaying quite a, quite a high performing game in the past matches. So, They've uh, managed to uh, plant the bomb. Team Vanity managed Last to plant the bomb. Standing. And they're trying to hold side. Oh, Jet, Jet gets the triple and gets the fourth kill. Uh, misses the ace earlier, but it's okay. It seems like Team Vanity is in control in the first match. First round uh, goes to Team Vanity. Do you think Robot Champions stand a chance? Um, I think I think they can they can try to get a close game because uh, judging from the previous match how they played, I think uh, their ranks are pretty high. But you know, ranks don't really matter if, uh, if you're gonna play bad. Uh, hopefully, um, they're they're true to their ranks. You know. Yep. You can see uh, Jet uh, actually better gets the double kill with the shorty, but fails to get the double kill. Yeah, I think he was reloading, right? Jet, Jet manages, yeah. Standing. Only had two bullets, but Jet manages to trade uh, her teammate, or two of her teammates, and gets a double kill. Mm. Uh, right now, Viper is uh, lurking Here. and trying to go to halls, but... Uh, all three of uh, all three players of Team uh, Vanity as on site holding every uh, angle, but I don't know how uh, Jenny K is going to clutch this with a short. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah. Um, is she AFK? Was she AFK? I'm not sure. I think so. That looks like a AFK to me. Yeah, let's hop into another stream, shall we? Look at you. Oh, that one's dead. Here it gets, uh, gets two kills. Okay, with a spray That's control, cool. he manages to cross in heaven. Um, my opinion, that was pretty hard for me to do because I don't have spray control and I just rely on headshots. But yeah, you can see here Sovets coming from CT trying to kill the sky, manages to kill the sky. Um, Brim is heading over to heaven uh, with a spark of Sova. Uh, but Omen manages to flank them and kill the Brim to uh, prevent him from smoking the site or uh, anywhere else. So it's a 3v1 situation. Sova is either going to save or try to flush it. But I think they're, uh, he's, he's going to run for it, uh, try to save his weapon. Um, Chamber picks up the phantom, throws it out, picks up another phantom for the skin. Uh, but they're still trying to find uh, the Sova, but they don't have time to move to the site to kill him. Yeah. 
Yeah, for now it's pretty one sided for any bro. Yeah. yeah, dominating the game for now. Let's head to um. Let's go back to confirm lose versus Thursday sport. Oh, it's one four. Confirm loses winning. I see. Well, they certainly doesn't hold up to their name. Oh yeah, I think Thursday Sport is winning. Thursday Sport is winning? Alright, yeah, yeah. Thursday Sport is winning. I was pretty, I was pretty uh, surprised there that Thursday Sport was yeah, same. one. I uh, kind of doubted that. But, you know. Off your feet! Yeah, we off. With all due respect, reach, reach both sides. Reach both uh, east side, and they the Sova tries to off to their. Uh... That was the default plan, so Sova knew where uh, where they were going. Ah, I see. One enemy remaining. Okay, it's a five v one situation, four v one situation, but I'm not sure if Chamber. Gonna clutch this as uh, he has a gun, and I don't think he's using an other gun. Yep. The that round goes to um confirm lose. You don't. Yeah, I, I see them coming back. There's a chance. That's a two of um Farsi stream. Oh, this is um, back to Monyak versus I love team I love, and uh, so far, um, I love is uh, dominating this, uh, this match. Yeah, uh, with the brim just uh, caught the triple kill, but let's see if uh, if he can win the round with a one v one. This will be interesting. But watch. as you can see. Sky is currently watching the bomb, deciding in the corner, and uh, let's see if Brim has the has the time to kill this guy. Gets the kill, uh, gets the fourth kill actually, and nice. uh, they proceed to the next round. Ahead. You will not kill my allies. Oh, this one is this match is 4 0. This any yeah. bro versus Upper Star Academy. And any bro is killing them. 30 seconds left. Yep, any bro is killing them. I think judging from the lineup that they have chosen for Eddie Bro, um, they're winning in attacking mode, but they're also good in a defense. Defending mode. One uh, enemy remains. As a Sage and Omen. Omen has a, a refreshable uh, smoke, uh, unlike Brim. Uh, Brim only has three smokes, but you uh, they won't be able to refresh. Omen has two smokes, but uh, the over time smokes will uh, will come back again, so they can reuse it. So. Uh, yeah, it seems like Confirm Lose got one round as well. Congrats to them. Yeah. Oh, it's Upper Star Academy. So. Oh, yeah, he's tripping, dog. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. Teleport ready. Let's head over to Team Vanity. So this is team back to Team Vanity versus Robots Champions with uh, Team Vanity attacking. They're trying to gain control of uh, B side, but they have Jet and Reina right behind the wall. Uh, 
Uh, right behind the player standing. Hold on. Yeah. Spike down B. Uh, two v one situation. Uh, both both of Sova and Chamber is currently in the CT spawn. Thirty seconds left. Uh, Chamber tries to secure the side. Just look around if there's any rats around. Uh, Sova is currently droning, trying to scan for the Oh, oh, is that wall bang? Right. Lucky for Dan. Yeah, that's a wall bang. Uh, the box is wall bangable. Yeah, that's a nice uh, one. I think he kind of for. Yeah, I think he kind of forgot that you can shoot through the wall because he just can't find the wall. So it's still. Uh, yeah, yeah. That, that was a close that one was as a well. Human error. Yeah. It's interesting. It's kind of close, to be honest. Yeah, it is so far as two, three. So, so like, both teams are performing. Uh, you know, quite evenly. Enemy mark. Is that like a fly, flying drone just now? Yeah, it's the Sova. Nice. Ah, it's the Sova drone, yeah. You can just launch it and uh, if you tag someone, they would be shown on the, the screen. Mm. They're doing it quite slow. Arena gets to pick one. Sova gets to pick another. Now it's a 3v3 situation. Uh, two of them actually is still with so we're just holding as well. Uh, okay, Arena gets another kill. Jet is coming from Hyper, uh, coming from CT. Jet fails to uh, get the ki any kill. Viper gets the first kill. Now it's a uh, on-site 1v1 situation with Viper uh, and CT playing lineups but it's possible that Viper can ult uh, quite early and try to counter uh, Sova's view of the bomb One enemy remaining uh, Yeah, there's, there's not enough time to defuse the bomb, yeah. uh, so they're just gonna get their uh, guns for next round. So uh, let's head over back to uh, Moniac versus I Love. It's Ooh. currently six three. It's quite close. Yeah, it's six four now. <laughs> It looks like both Moniac teams just are... secured another round. Yeah. Looks like both teams are playing quite evenly, which is something that we like to see. Yep. I noticed that he actually shot the wind shot through the window like every starting match. Why is it so? Uh which window? Oh uh, okay. So is that like in heaven when they're going up the ramps and then to the right? Yep. Okay, so basically the window is um uh it's a it's a way for the attacking team to like bait out. So if they want to go through that window, they'd have to shoot the window first, right? And obviously that would that would um, alert the defending team of the position, but it can also be used to uh, bait. So they can shoot it from far away, and then instead of going through the window, they would go through the door. So I yeah. see. 
Oh, it's a comic skin. Yeah, I recognize this. Yeah, it's a comic skin. Damn, I was a bit off, but uh, yeah, failed to get the kill. The hunt begins. All all of the uh, attacking team players have entered the site. Um, have also closed the door. Oh, you can actually. But there's it. currently. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it can also be destroyed. Killjoy ulted, but Brim ults uh, the Killjoy ult to counter the ult. I love only God is using an Odin, which is pretty uh, cringe. Cringe player. It's round six. I mean, it's round ten, and it's already using an Odin. Odin and an up. But it's a uh, spray, you know, brain spray. Brain spray gun, just like that. And it goes back to uh, take the up for the next round. Yeah, let's, let's hop into... Oh my days. Last player standing. One enemy remaining. Whoa. What yeah. is going on here? I think Tosi spot is switching sides. Excuse me. Uh I think Tosi spot is pretty dominant dominating the entire game. I got enough time to go yeah. into the Astro Fall. Out of 12 rounds, turn around this goes to uh, Thurs Esport. Now it's their turn to uh, defend. Uh, let's see how they do, but since they have Astro and, uh, and Chamber, I think I think they're pretty set on defending. Um, confirmed lose had probably had troubles defending because they only have one one controller, and that is Chamber. Mm -hmm. um, so it's, it's pretty hard to defend. So are you saying they are main attacking? Um, not I mean it's their 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 team is hard to attack and to defend. Without concealment, it's like it's quite a. They just did. It's like I think they just like selected their uh, best playing uh, agent, what they play best instead of what's best for the team. Ah, I see. Yeah, because there's like not a lot of synergies. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, to be honest, I think Thirst Esport is supposed to have, is supposed to have some, some trouble, a lot of trouble attacking because they don't have any um, agents to entry with. They don't have any... Um, Spike down, B. Oh. Ooh, that was... They only had Sova to entry with, which they can just destroy the door. Ah, I see. Yeah, how about let's hop into a closer match between B. and Robox Champion. Robox Champion is actually holding up pretty well. Yeah, they're holding up pretty well. Can they be the underdog and with bad team? A new a new breed of uh, valent players to uh to counter the team uh, team vanity here. Yep. That's a good spot. But, but, uh, I think their APU has an uh, official um like club right for a game. Do you think yep, it's? Do you think? Do you, in spot. your opinion, do you think? Uh, Good idea for APU to create its own esports. Yeah. yeah, definitely. I think the, I think actually the main idea behind uh, the esports club is actually the same for our competition as well. We're trying to bring people together through this game and have uh, everybody connect with one and each other and just have a fun session around, just for fun, and everybody can relax and chill, have a good game. Shock dart. Yep, I, th I think there's a lot of potential for uh, some AP students who are really good at this game. Um, I, I'm actually hoping that uh, one day, like sometime in the future, someone could host uh, a cross-university cross, cross university tournament. Mm -hmm. 
where APU the best of the best of APU students would compete against other universities like um, MMU or, or any of these, uh, other universities. Yeah, that would be a very interesting idea. Yeah, definitely looking forward to it. If there's one. Spike down, B. Uh, maybe I need to brush up my Valorant uh, knowledge before I can go into that. Ten seconds left. <laughs> one enemy sure. remaining. Oh, okay. Last player standing. One tap. Let's see if we can get the second tap. Oh, oh unlucky. He ran out of bullets. Jenny K gets a four K. Now back to spectating Q1 Lulu. Um, I think for the majority of the time when we're on this team, when we're spectating this team, we're always on uh, Q1 Lulu. But uh, it's nice to see uh, uh, POVs from other players other than Q1 Lulu. Um, so I tried to get some info on the side, there, but the Viper's wall kind of uh, blocked it. Yeah. They're now on side. Jet and Viper is currently trying to flank. Uh, as you can see on the map, Viper is actually watching the flank just to make sure no one's flanking. But uh, Viper gets the first kill. Let's see if uh, Jet manages to trade him. Oh, Jet fails to trade uh, her teammate, and Viper gets the second kill. Now, all I have to do is uh, kill everyone on side. The Sova and Arena. But let's see if they can try to regain sight and defuse the bomb. Last player standing. Oh. Uh. Uh. Hmm. Yeah, Unlucky for Sova. Yep. It doesn't really seem like Roblox Last is round in the half. actually pretty even in terms of yep. strength and skills in Valorant against Team Vanity. Which is one of the hot, uh, say, most highly anticipated teams uh, in our tournament. A huge uh, supportive team as well. But as you can see right now, currently Roblox champion is actually in the lead just by one round. But that, that, that's not too big. Let's see if she can get the pick. She gets the first kill. And uh, she finally gets her ult. See if she, she, if she, let's see if she can pick another kill here. But as you can see on the map, everyone else is, uh, everyone else is A side. There is only the uh, lurker in the B side. The arena was lurking, trying to fake side. And I've just received uh, the latest news that Terrace Esport has won again, confirmed news with a very warm match. Very well played. Like congratulations in making it to the semi-final list. One enemy remaining. Team Ace. So let's let's see. Um, oh, they got an Ace. They got a Team Ace. So ace. Yeah. Everyone pretty much they got a kill. Let's head over to Monyak versus I Love. Um, nine six with uh, with I Love attacking currently. Oh, that was huge, but uh, the sky fails to get any kill. 30 mm. seconds left. Oh. Rina gets a cheeky kill there. Oh, gets the wall bang because they actually planted for default, so... That was a very quick round. So that was, yeah, yeah. that was a quick round. Yeah, I'm really curious to see how this pans out between these two teams. Yeah, it's very interesting. Yeah, I think that? Uh, that round, team, yeah. uh, team, team, I love Ashley shouldn't have planted yet. They should have just cleared site, you know, just kill everybody that's close to the site. But mm. 
they just plant it and yeah, loses the round. I see. Yeah, should we head over to any bro? This is Upper Star Academy, which is actually very close as well. That works. And yeah, the starting match would mean a switch side happening. So let's see yep. if Agro can hold up to their lead, or will they be passed by Upper Star Academy? Oh, according to one of our uh, members, uh, confirmed news versus eSport included with a score of 13 2. There's eSport winning, so that's quite a huge gap. Yep. 13 2. Spike down A. And for confirmed news, don't be sad. You made it to the last eight, which is pretty impressive in terms of 48 teams. So, congrats as well. Um, yeah, we're going to release the first eSport and the semi final round later. Here. Healing over here. One enemy remaining. Both players are whiffing. Last player standing. Clutch. Oh, that's the longest this stage stand clutches. <laughs> Point zero two seconds. Yeah, that's a nice clutch. But that is also the longest standoff that I have seen. <laughs> Usually, yeah, they both just saw each other and one of them goes down. But both of them are just shooting at air constantly. Yeah, I think the jet was panicking as soon as he misses like the fifth shot. Yeah, and then follows up by more misses. Let's head over back to ascent. Yep. Uh, this is uh, Monyak first I love. Yeah, let's go to the match. Right here. Someone is using Odin, but I'm not sure who. But I think it's someone in the in, in defending team. I think it's the uh, chamber who's using the uh, Odin. Mm. Launching smoke! Seems like Jet is opping mid, trying to kill the Killjoy, and it's uh, their, her, her third shot, but still no kill. Yeah. Fourth shot now, and Spike finally down. Jet dies in mid with uh, no kills. Taken out. Thirty seconds left. Out of charges. Seek them out. One enemy They're trying to push mid here, but Sky just obliterates both of them with the Odin, just spray and pray with the item. But they can't really do anything because they had their knives out and there was like 15 seconds left. So they were yeah. really trying to rush side here. This is a pretty close match between Monia and I Love, and currently I Love is having the lead with only one point ahead, and it's 10 versus 9 for now. There.
Because I ult tried to do it right. Like both Brim have ult. Oh, she actually faked it. I've got your so trade. She faked ult so they would uh, bait the Brim to ult back. But they're actually trying to push A now. Wow. Jed gets the kill. Secures heaven, trying to kill him. Gets the second kill. The one time. Gets the third kill. Let me also get the fourth kill. Yeah, that was it. Quad kill. Yeah, that was kill, I'd say. But they, they, use, they don't use this term in Veteran, right? No, they don't. They use it illegal. But Grim saves it all for One post plant. Hmm? But as you can see, Soba is actually not playing post plant. He's trying to rotate back to heaven. Uh, ult from heaven. He doesn't get the kill, but now he's just holding his ult. Oh, he, he fails to get uh, to defend his bomb. Now it's an equal uh, score of 10 10. Yeah. Uh, hop into Team Vanity versus Roblox as the score is pretty even as well. Uh, to the viewers currently watching the stream, keep in mind that we have changed the um, overtime to a sudden death, so you would need to win the last game in the entire match. Yep. Hussein gets a double kill, but uh, Blue Fall kills him. Welcome to my world. Viper also, she can safely plant. And uh, I think they're just going to play uh, on site. I don't think Viper is going to play any more. It's, uh, too much where it's quite hard to, do, to play lineups. Yep. So 1v2, currently it's a 1v2. They're trying to find where the Viper is, uh, Viper, so this Viper is currently trying to get in, but she's quite afraid, as you might think that the enemy Viper is holding the corner. Oh, Jenny Ooh. K gets the triple kill triple and wins kill. the round. Oh, triple kill. Oh, well, that's a good round. Let's head over to um, any bro versus the uh, first star academy. Yeah, Only all seven these are quite, quite even. Yep. Smoke's down. Timber gets the first kill with an off. They're just trying to rush heaven here and get the side. Th but I think now they've, they've secured side. They uh, have Wraith trying to hold heaven. Spike planted. Gets the plant, and I think this round goes to um, Team Upper Star. Player standing. Yeah. Interesting. 
Eric somehow knew where uh, she was. Oh, Omen is trying to save his gun. Fails to get the kill. Yeah. Jet fails to get to get the kill. And just Omen is just holding a trying to save his gun for the next round. That round goes to a team of Rissar. Let's switch to... I think this is... Uh... Oh, that's just a close one. This is Monyet versus I Live. And it's come to a tie, you know. Both of the team has a score of 11. You should run! Shields are old uh, B site. Mm -hmm. Reyna is still holding an A site despite uh, despite their teammates, all of their teammates heading over to uh, B site. You can see this guy is just holding both sides, but cannot hold both sides because there's two, two uh, enemies trying to uh, Last okay. player standing. Uh, 3v1. Okay. Well, that's a well played by I Love. Next point. This will be the concluding match if they can hold up. Let's see if uh, I Love can. Uh, can get this match in the bag so they can proceed to uh, yeah. the finals. Smoke's down. They're all holding, uh, they're gonna push Catwalk to a uh, garden and to a side, but there is considered the brim. But I think the brim is gonna die here if he doesn't move. They're gonna definitely check that corner. Yep, there you go. Brim dies. And as you can, Reyna and their crossfire. Let's see if they kill the Reyna. See the hit. Kills the Reyna. And they now have secured side. So I yeah. think we can see that uh, Team I Love is, gonna, is going to win this round. Or the one. There you go. Team I Love uh, wins that match. Yep. So I think there's one remaining match left. Yeah. They actually concluded. And for this is any bro versus Upper Star. Yeah, Team Vanity against Roblox has concluded as well. Team Vanity won 3-8. Uh, yep. With a... Uh, Mm -hmm. This is three. That uh, was his eight. Sorry. Okay. Yep. So it's not too bad so far. All of the scores are not too bad. There's uh, yep. 13, 11, 13, 8, except uh, Thirsty East Park versus Confirmed Blues. That was pretty devastating, which uh, the score was yeah. 13 uh, to 2. Yeah. There's quite a huge skill gap there. But as you can see, they're still trying to decide where to go. It looks like they're gonna push mid. Just as soon as uh, Raze backs out and Sage holds Heaven, they have uh, secured Heaven Cubby. Yeah. But I think Sage knows that the entire team left. is in uh, Heaven. Um, mm. they're, they're trying to... So there's Chamber actually lurking back to A. Uh, trying to right. see if the enemy Chamber is gonna... Uh, rotate, but seems like they will back as they have. Spike oh. down. Enough. Ten seconds left. One enemy remaining. Okay, it's a three-one situation right now. Uh, yeah, they're doing their own. Yeah. Around goes to any bro. Let's 
let's make them dance. As you can see, Ray is using a uh, an Odin. I don't think she can hit headshots or anything. Cover so she just uh, prefers to spray and pray that her shots gonna hit someone in the head and get to kill. Yeah, they broke the wall already, and they're slowly pushing mid while the rest of the team is just holding a side. Uh, I mean a main, but they're waiting for the smoke to go out. Uh, just in case anybody pushes them. But as you can see on the map, Sage is currently holding mid. Uh, Jet is trying to get the peak on her, but I don't think she's gonna get any. Uh, he was free. Um, there. She gets the kill, manages to get the Sage kill, and Omen smokes, Omen smokes heaven to prevent the team from pushing. Now they're gonna fully rotate uh, A side since there's only chamber holding uh, A side. Spike Kills down. the chamber. No, oh, actually, chamber went back to screens. But it's smoke, so he can't do really anything. 30 seconds left. But yeah. Uh, Any bro actually forgot. Wait, no, Upper Star Academy actually forgot to take the bomb, so they won't be able to plant this yet. Now they're planting. Ooh. Damn. Upper star manages to get the round. Yeah. And that ties up again. Currently a 4v3 situation, and Brim gets the kill, Raze gets another kill, uh, let's see if, um, let's see if Benibro can uh, defend. They're playing 2-3, three, 3 garage actually, actually, 2 garage and everything else. Is okay, Eric gets the no scope. Uh, doesn't not, does not check backside. Let me to check because they're actually close firing. But... Last player standing. Yep. I foresaw that because they have not checked uh, backside yet. They just yeah. uh, peeked a bit. Here. So I'm actually gonna head over to one of the uh, team's voice chats and see how they're communicating. Um, they are so dead. I think both teams are uh, pretty calm and giving their calm so far. You know, they're calm, they're they're communicating a lot. Mm. <laughs> 
Jed dashes in. 30 seconds left. Jed gets the kill. I think we're gonna get pick another kill. Oh, Phil's gonna get a kill. Sage gets a double kill. Brim trades the jet and kills the sage. Now it's a 2v2 situation. If Brim can get the plant, I think he can just play for a uh, post plant. But he's trying to get out of the place he's at. Chamber gets the headshot through the uh, through the box. Let's see if he can snipe the. Yep. So Chamber gets a headshot. I mean the the kill. Yeah. Now it's 11 11. This is pretty close game. This is really tense. There. 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 You want to play? Let's play. That's his gun! <laughs> yeah, this is very intense. And I think according to time, they'll be hopping into the semi final match very uh right just right after they've ended this match. So maybe a very very intense uh back to back rounds for them for either team that won. <laughs> Spike planted. Four B Okay, Chamber gets the triple kill. Oh, guess the fourth kill. Let's see if we can get the ace. Ace. Hopefully, it can get the ace. Are we going to see? Are we going to see ace? No, no. Raze gets the one tap, but I don't think. Uh, let's see if Chamber is gonna go and get the his ace. Hopefully, he can get his ace. Yeah. Okay, he's getting close. Let's see. Checking let's every see. corner. Takes the op Oh, oh kills. Charges. Instead, Raze gets a fourth kill. Yeah. Match point. No, it's match point. Yeah. So there's actually um, Soba just holding garage right now, um, whilst the yeah. uh, other players hitting in mid and um, at A site. But they've, they've, they've secured A site. If you can see the map, they've actually secured A site. They have no idea that there's no more enemies there. But I don't think they know that. But all three of the defending team players are actually rotating back to A site after that first kill. And just because of that, Omen is left vulnerable alone at B side. Uh, he gets killed, and now they've secured B side. Although there's uh, just three players left, it's a three v three, 
But Sage gets the revive and uh, A-side revives the uh, race to, to make it uneven, uh, to give themselves uh, the uh, advantage and upper hand. So, Jet is actually trying to flank both of them, but she cannot get the kill because there's a smoke in front of her. But she's trying to play the waiting game. She gets the first kill, fails to get the second kill. Whoa. Whoa nice. Brim gets the final kill from the garage. What's that ability? Like, you can just levitate? It's a knife. What? Yeah, yeah. You can levitate. It's up jam. It's called up jam. That's so foul. You can just levitate. What? Yeah, but it leaves you vulnerable in the air. So, and you can't use your gun as well because your gun will be out of aim. Ah, I see. So you can only just use your knife? Yeah. I see. So that concludes this bracket. Um, yep. All of the teams have shown quite uh, quite a good match. Um, most of the team ended up in quite close game. We have actually two teams that ended up 13-11. I think it was this team and was it um, was yep. it Team Vanity or was it I think it was Team Vanity, right? Yeah, Team Vanity won. Uh, yeah, Team yeah, Vanity. And actually, and the only Vanity got out of this tournament. Yeah. It's Upper Star oh. Academy oh. who got the upper hand in this match. And yeah. That was a pretty close game, definitely. Yep. And we'll definitely see uh, Upper Star Academy performing as well in the Semi-finals as uh, any bro is a pretty respectable player, respectable team I would say, and they have been holding up very well in their previous matches. Since uh, Upper Star Academy can take them down, it means like they have something up their sleeves. So in the finals, we actually have Team Vanity versus I Love. And also Tus Esports versus Upper Star Academy. All four very strong teams and have proven on the stream as well. So let's take a look and see what they can bring to the semi-final rounds. Well, who do you think is gonna win semi-finals uh, between Team Vanity and uh, Yeah, let's, let's, let's have a prediction here. Yeah. Um I think Team Vanity and Upper Star Academy. Upper Star about, Academy. Yeah, how about how about you? Um I think I think Thirst Esports has a lot of potential. I still think. Uh but like like I said earlier before the match, I have three 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 um teams that I think are gonna win this uh, tournament, which is Team Vanity in first, Thirst Esports in second, and Enable in third yeah. place. And I mm -hmm. think Judging from how Thirst Esports played against Confirm Loose, despite it having a quite a large uh, skill gap, um, just just like just how they played, I think I think Thirst Esports could secure the second spot. If not first, actually, um, there might be an interesting match if, if, if Thirst Esports win this uh, bracket. Mm, interesting, yeah. And while we wait for the semi-finals match to start. I just want to give a reminder to all of the viewers uh, watching at home, either from the uh, YouTube or Facebook, please uh, be sure to join our giveaway luck for the lucky draw of a 50 ringgit uh, prize, cash prize. So all you need to do is go to the link in our comment right now and head to there and accomplish all of the rules and steps given which is to like, comment, and share our posts, and as well as follow us on Instagram. And you get a chance to win the 50 ringgit cash prize after uh, we draw it out after the finals have concluded. So yeah, let's take a look at one of the lobbies that is starting right now. And the map they're playing on is Ascent. Interesting. 
So this is uh, Team I Love versus Team Vanity. Let's see if Team I Love can hold on and overcome the hardest, I, I would say, like the, the uh, strongest team rapid uh, in this competition for now. So yeah, just like I said, Team Vanity has a history of winning streaks in past tournaments. So I yeah. wonder if I love could uh, could could meet up to the uh, uh, potential that Team Vanity holds, and uh, mm -hmm. possibly even win against Team Vanity. But I think we'll see in this uh, this match soon enough. Yep. So based on the lineup, what do you think? Um, they both have sofas, which is pretty really good. This a sofa is a necessary necessity in this in this in this, uh, this map. Uh, a lot of lineups, uh, a lot of uh, strategies that you can play with sofa here post plant mm -hmm. or just like pre um, before the match starts. Um, I think I think they're pretty equal, but instead of um, they only have one blind for the defending team. They only have the sky, so you have to rely on the sky. While the attacking team has Omen and um, Reina, so they have a total of three uh, blinds. While uh, Sky only, I mean, yes, yeah, Sky has two two blinds. Mm. But as you can see here, um, attacking team um, decides to play mid, trying to push mid or trying to push catwalk. There's two, two people, two players currently holding grass. Sky and Jet is currently holding grass. Um, they're trying to get this mid control here. Now let's take a look from the other stream. Oh, it's the same POV. Same POV, but uh, different team. Vanity manages to get the mid control, but Killjoy gets a double kill, which trades both of his teammates. 2v1 situation with, um, I think it was Suzanne who was playing Jet for Team Vanity. Let's see if she can. Oh, I love Dory gets the one tap instead, and the first yeah. round goes to Team I Love. Yeah, it seems like Team I Love got the first round in the bag. Let's see how Team Vanity responds to this. Surprisingly, um, I think, yeah, all the, since there's only yet two matches currently running, both matches are, are played in the set. So, this is the POV of uh, Suze. Now we're back to a uh, POV. Yep. That's a blind shot. Also, viewers from YouTube and also Facebook, comment down who you think uh, is going to make it into the champion stage. Now they're just trying to rush mid. They're trying to regain mid again, hmm. as they have failed the previous round. But so far they've gotten back. Uh, they've gotten into market. Um, now they have secured site. As you can see in the map, there's nobody holding site. Sova, um, for Team Isle of is actually playing a, a main. And now hmm. let's see if Sova will get the kill uh, against Reina. Oh, Reina gets the one tap. Q1 Nulu gets the one tap. Yeah. Let's see if she uh, she's gonna pick up the uh, Aries here, or she's gonna just remain and play uh, the sheriff. So they're trying to kill this Reina right now instead of trying to get inside. Oh, hey, second round goes to Team Vanity. Yep. And let's look at the other semi round. 
semi-final round, which is Upper Star Academy versus Tears Esport, with Tears Esport defending currently. Interesting, but uh... oh, okay. Wow, that was nice to manage to kill three for one. Damn, that was one a nice trade. Spike down A. Yeah, that was a very quick round. Everybody was grouped together and yeah. Placing sentry. Coming back out of charges, placing sentry. Turret destroyed. So there's actually a lurker in uh, Sova, the lurking right now in the uh, A side. Hmm. KO ma manages to kill the One lurker in A side. Remains. Now they're just pressuring they're going to a B lobby, but uh, yeah, he lost gets the double kill. So, so far, both rounds to um, Team uh, Thirst Esports, um, they've been playing quite well so far. I hope they keep it up. Yep, I agree. But I definitely want to see Upper Star Academy do their best as well. I think Upper Star Academy was lacking behind in like the last round, last match as well. And they managed to come back and get the match and move into the semi finals against any bro. So yeah, that's definitely a chance for them. One enemy remaining. Spike down mid. <laughs> I get what I want. One enemy remaining. Yeah, I would say Tuesday Esports is doing very well in this place.
Oh, down. okay, what a massacre. Last player. Right now. Oh, he gets flanked. Trova flanks and gets the last double kill. Defenders win. Wait, Wait what? what? Wait, what? Are they for what? real? Why did they surrender? I have no idea. It's it's uh, Upper Star Academy surrender, right? Okay, let me just com double confirm in that Discord real quick. Okay, that was a very interesting round. So I have no idea why they surrendered. Oh, they're um, saying they have zero one of chance. The mods confirmed. What? Yep. They are trying to use the time to have dinner. They have zero chance. Have so they just surrendered. Yep, they're trying to have a better chance to win the bronze, the bronze match. Actually, they're preparing for it as they have their stomach uh filled with dinner okay that's a first yep uh anyhow uh congrats to tourist esports and making into the finals they would either be in uh the champions or uh i would say the runner up interesting what is yeah give up very interesting. So let's. I mean, even in. if I was hungry, right? I would just eat and play. Damn, you you can do that. Yeah, that's wait, very you impressive. Wait, how you you play Valorant with both hands, right? Yeah, but I can just eat with a spoon. Hmm. They are standing. One enemy remaining. Hold on to your hats. Not the boom you hoped for. Need a quick thanks. Time out. Time out. Trying to get the off kill on the solar, but fails. Ahead. Yep. Let's see what the uh, Jets POV looks like. Currently, three guys, and oh my god, misses two shots. 
Three shots, I was at the first shot, couldn't get any kill. Um, yeah. But right now, Team I Love is, uh, is, is quite holding up. We're a 4 yep. score. It's a quite even score. And that that was a nice beat. But Sova will try uh, to get the skill here. Just Ooh. trying to shoot from above. Oh, they did not know Oman was still holding the help. Wow. And the round goes to Team My Love. Team My Love actually having the lead against Team Vanity. Yep. So do you think Team Vanity can come back on this? I think they still can if they change up their strategy and how they play. But as you can see, uh, um, so far, so Team uh, Love is actually just trying to get as much rounds in defense. Uh, you can tell because Soba is playing Odin and that's mud. Uh, I Love Zen gets the kill. Uh, against Suzanne, Oops. trying to get the uh, okay better offer, and I think this round goes to Team I Love unless Omen and Sova can clutch. Nice. Yeah. Oh, uh, a headshot, yeah. and Brim gets the trade in. Yeah, it's currently 6 to 4, not in the favor of Team Vanity. Let's take a look at the, another point of view. Jeez, Jeez. Jeez. Okay, Sova tagged a lot of uh, people but did not get any kills, they tagged two uh, different people. Yep. Oh, okay. Brim gets the kill and burns uh, a member of uh, Team Vanity Alive. Now the mm. score is 7-2 with, uh, with uh, Team I Love dominating this match right now. Yeah. Yeah. Sova with the Odin. Odin play. He's been playing Odin for like four rounds. I think that's the reason uh, they're they're able to get this much rounds in. Mm. Yeah, they're starting to pulling to pull away. Yep. Would the switch sides help in terms of Team Vanity's current situation? Um. Uh, yeah, I think so, but it might still be hard because. Mm. Actually, team team I love will have a hard time um, attacking because they only have one um, one duelist, which is Jet, and the rest is pretty much support. Damn. And its score but is eighteen. Flawless. Yeah. That's insane. I think if Team Vanity gets one round in to make the score uh, um, nine three. I think they would have a chance of uh, winning if the score is 9 3. Hopefully, uh, hopefully Team Vanity will uh, come back. Yep. Yeah, I'm still in shock that the Upper Star Academy just. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Yeah, yeah, continue. What? No, no, you first, you first. Oh, no, I, I was saying like, there's like risking the second or champion or first place for dinner in exchange to trying to get third place, which is not guaranteed, you know? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, from their point of view, I think, I, I, I can understand because you won't be able to focus on an empty stomach. Like, if I was hungry, like, I think yesterday I kind of slowed down in the commentary because I was actually sitting, you know, for, we, we've been sitting for like hours just commentating. Yeah. And, uh, you know, I was, I, I got, I got really hungry and, you know, I slowed down on commentating. So I kind of understand why they would want to risk semifinals just to get their energy back up so they can compete uh, at their peak in the fourth third place. Yeah. But like I said, um, I think they can just um, multitask, you know, they can at least try for semifinals as well as trying to fill up the belly and still um, compete uh, at, at their at their peak for uh, third place. Hmm. Yeah, oh. Yeah, Team Vanity actually brought that one match and it's up 8 yep. to 3 for now, closing in the gap, but not, uh, I would say, not close enough. And they will need to work harder and try to outplay Team I Love, which is doing very well in terms of uh, this match and the entire tournament. Yeah, I'm actually going to predict this match that. Team Vanity is gonna win if the score gets to nine three, because oh, yeah. nine three is basically it's a common score in the Valorant community. That if you're if the score is nine three and you're winning, you're most likely lose the entire match after that. It's oh. it's called the nine three curse because the losing team, which has three three scores in, ends up coming back and clutching and winning the entire match. Ah, nice to and know that, about that. That happens quite commonly, yeah. Mm. So, in order to avoid this curse, are they trying to get uh, a loss in this match and have it like eight four instead of nine three? Yeah. 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 So now I think it's gonna be eight four, right? Yeah. <laughs> Same. I mean, so, there's there's no statistics to back it up. It's just it's something that happens quite quite often. It's a common thing. Yeah. Yeah. Urban yeah. myth in the like, Valorant I, community. Yeah, some of that. Yeah, yeah. So as soon as they see that nine three, they're just gonna say, "Oh, we're gonna lose," and they actually end yeah. up losing. So, so it's uh, still in speculation if Team I Love uh, purposely lost this match or. Does Team Vanity really outplay them? <laughs> trying <laughs> trying just to, to avoid, avoid the nine three curse. Yeah. And just to make sure, just to make sure. <laughs> just in case it's true. Yeah. <laughs> well, let's take a look from the other side. Okay, Chamber gets the first kill. Sova gets the second kill. One enemy remaining. Oh, okay. Seems like he went to get this round. Oh, Sova yeah, has lightning. Slowly coming back. Yeah. Yep, slowly coming back. They have uh, the agents. Their, the agent selection have a higher higher chance, higher upper hand. I, I'd say upper hand for this map. They are better at uh, defending. But uh, team I love actually will have some struggles in attacking in this map. 
they only have uh, one one entry so they cannot entry as fast as uh, let's say the uh, team vanity mm, okay nice kiwa nulu gets a second kill and they obliterate team uh, i love just like that yeah. for, the, uh, for the rush Man. so he gets four kills with the uh, ghost the score is definitely closing in yeah this is intense can team i love secure their lead or would they be overcome by team manatees undying effort in trying to score and tying the game Seems like there's three players currently um, trying to push Catfog. Jet is watching it right now, watching that spot. They're pushed. Oh, okay. Okay. Chamber manages to get one kill because the jet enemy jet fails to uh, check that corner. Yeah. Sova apparently has layups. Thirty seconds left. Spike planted. Last player standing. You disappoint me. Okay. Kiwon Lulu might be able to um, clutch this round mm. if she uh, saves up her heels on time. But I think she's just going yeah. to save and try to get exit frags. That's one. Oh, fails to get the rest. Yeah. Round goes to Team My Love. Nine three. This is definitely intense. We've only got being the top frag for Team I Love and uh, the Chinese name for the Team Frag in I Love. Let's see from the other, the other, other um, uh, POB. Bot coming back. Thirty seconds left. Spike down A. Find that. Doesn't look really good for Team I Love currently. So, yeah. for the cruise situation. 
Let's see if they can get the plant in. Oh, they do not have the bomb. Yeah. I think the spike carrier died. Uh, quite close to the base of uh, the spike A, and that's why they couldn't retrieve it. Guy tags the trainer twice, but did not get the kill. Oh, Reina is really with him right now. Yeah. Roman gets a smoke and tries to push, but both of them are trying to get back to CT. It's a 5 8 2. Spike down, attacker spawn. Gets the first kill, but fails to get the last kill. Oh, okay. Nice. Yeah. Jeff with the right click gets the kill. Uh, let's take a look at a different point of view. So yeah, Team Vanity actually managed to close in on the gap. Which uh, I think the furthest was eight versus three, and they managed to close it with yep. a nine to eight lead from Team I Love, and they're only one round away from tying the score. You should run. Yeah, a lot of people have high hopes for Team Vanity, and they be sure to deliver it. As you can see, Kyojo and Sky is just playing wine cellar. And oh, okay. Just just playing post plant. I think Kyojo has placed their mollies onto the bomb. One enemy remaining. Oh, they won't have time to defuse. Yeah. And the round goes to um, Team My Love. Yeah, Team I Love is trying to seal the deal and get to 13 as soon as possible. While Team Vanity tries to catch up and tie and possibly overcome and win this match. Seems like they've managed to push CT. Um, I've never seen that play before, actually. Oh. Spike down A. 
That was a really, well, a really sus play, to be honest. But mm. the play by Team My Love. Where they pushed mid instead of going to market, they just pushed uh, CT. Uh, rarely happens, but you know, maybe, maybe this team thinks differently. And it's mm -hmm. not just push a CT. Yeah, let's switch to the other point of view. For now. Right here. They're just holding A side. Yep. But they're all stacking B for. Uh, Smoke down. They're just gonna rush. Oh, Jets rushes. Forget, check, forget, 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 check that corner. And then Super gets pretty much triple kill. And yeah. uh, Team Vanity wins that round. The rush doesn't seem like a pretty good idea in terms of the outcome for the last round. Yeah, they're basically in a three versus five situation, but they couldn't get uh, the kills. Time to hunt. Scout destroyed. Seek them out. It seems like they already got the bomb planted. Oh, okay. Omen gets the first kill uh, against the uh, team I love. There's currently one lurking in Catbox. Brim ults to cancel the kills. But I think they know that they're chilling in wine. That's a 2v2 situation. Sova still has the uh, first kill. Let's see if uh, Jet can beat out the uh, ult. I don't think there's time now. Yep. There isn't time and the run goes to the team I love. Yeah, congrats. That's a pretty intense match. Yes, neck and neck and down to the last player. Yeah, they're grouping up at site B again. Killjoy ults, and let's see if they could destroy it. But um, Soba, enemy Soba does not have it ult, so um, he will not be able to cut it. And as you can see in the map, Soba and Jet is actually trying to flank from the mid. But yeah. uh, they have already secured the site. Yep. I Double kill from uh, Isle of Dory. Um, now she's gonna hold market, uh, but I think Killjoy knows that the other two players are. Gets that kill. Jet still doesn't get the kill, and she tries to get away. 
Uh, he's trying to root it, but I think I think they're just now going to save. They're going to save their guns for next round uh, because mm -hmm. next round uh, we'll show who will win this match. <laughs> this score will be 12 10. Only God gets another kill, and it's now it is Jeff who is still alive trying to get exit frags, but she's saving her up right now. Match point. Now it's match point, and the lead goes to um, Team My Love. That was quite a flash, flash his own team. Oh, mm. Spike okay. down, mid. So that's down, two versus four. Last player standing. Team one versus four. four versus one now. Ooh. And this round goes to Team Bennett. Well played. They're really Sorry. trying to uh, sweat it out and try to win the next two rounds here. Yep. It's going to be intense because we're. It's uh, because for overtime, as long as you get to 13, you win the match. So definitely yep. a sweat break team for Team Vanity trying to get back into the game and tie and possibly over win over team I love in this situation. We might see a 12 versus 12. Deploying drone. Enemy tag. Soba gets a scan here and Chamber leads to to grass and um, back to heaven. But uh, as you can see there's two players currently trying to pull mid uh, Soba area. and Grim. And the rest are in B side. Jet is actually pushing uh, B main, trying to pick oh. for some kills, but he smokes it and then uh, backs out. And now their uh, team, now team uh, I love is trying to push catwalk. Uh, as you can see, uh, Killjoy is trying to rotate back to uh, A main. Um, but it seems like the majority of the team is rotating to A. Uh, team Vanity gets their first kill. Uh, Trying to secure the bomb, but uh, oh, now it's a really fast situation. Sober does not have uh, a place to open. He's trying to play a post plan, but since it's a 4v1, he won't be able to. Uh, I think at this point, one could just defuse, and the other guy could just uh, push the Sober. Sober dies, and, uh, and the score. This is a very interesting match. Okay. Next is the tiebreaker. Whoever wins the next match wins the game. Sudden death. Sudden death. So now they have to play safe or they have to stack the site. Yep. Yeah, just. Just like how I predicted, Team I Love is just stacking one side and they're probably trying to attempt the rush again. Yep. But hopefully the Chamber and Team Vanity uh, would be able to uh, stop the push. This is about to go down. Time to hunt. Sky uses her dog to secure corners. Okay, that's a lineup. It's quite a lineup, but that did not deal any much damage. But as you can see, Jet is actually in the smoke. Spike oh. down. Team Vanity kills uh, two of the teammates. Uh, Isle of Dory and Isle of Eco uh, managed to trade them, and now it's a 3v3 situation. Yeah. They are not able to plant yet because they do not have the bomb. 
Yeah. Placing some grenades. Yeah, securing the site. Kunzoi tries to yeah. get you. Yeah. Yeah. Kunzoi planted the spike. Let's see if they can hold Kunzoi it out. Kunzoi does not have any mollies, so she won't be able to play post plant at all. Uh, mm. They're trying to slowly decide where to push. But uh, if we go to uh, first as uh, POV, we can see that Sova is using an Odin. Just to spare mm. the enemy. Now it's a 2v2, it's a 1v2. Let's see if Jet would watch this. 1v1 situation. Oh my no, god, Vanity fails to clutch. The yeah. Vanity fails to clutch and the run goes to Team Island. That was a pretty close game. Yes, that's a really intense match. Well done to both teams as well. And congratulations to uh, Team Island to making in the finals, which would be uh, facing against Team. Uh, Team Tourist Esports, yes, and they won by uh, the other team surrendering, which is the Upper Star Academy. And the Upper Star Academy will be fighting Team Vanity for the third place later on. While well, we have our final list as uh, Team I Love, which proven to be very competitive and up to the standards against Team Vanity and against uh, Tourist Esports for the finals. So I think we're now going to have a break, if I'm correct. Yep. All right. And we are going to have a quick break. So before that, I would just like to remind again that uh, our giveaway is going to announce. Uh, it's going to be announced after the finals and also the third place match has been concluded. So be sure to stay tuned there, and. We'll announce who will be winning the 50 ringgit lucky draw. So we'll be back soon.
Welcome back everyone and it's 8 p.m. right now and we will be starting the final match very soon. And just a recap on the finalists. We have team I Love versus Tears Esports and for the team playing for the third place match we have team Vanity versus Upper Star Academy. All four teams are proven to be very strong and let's see how this will pan out especially after the weird uh actions by Upstart academy to drop out of the semi-finals just to have dinner and focus on this uh third place match let's hop right into the first match So yeah, just a reminder for finals and the third place match, uh, there won't be sudden death. They'll be back to uh, win win the match by uh, two rounds. Yep. And apparently we are playing split on the third place match. Select your agent. Select the agent. <laughs> Yep, let's 
let's take a look at the first place match. So this is the other match was Vanity versus uh, Upper Star, right? Uh, yep. And this is I and love this one's uh, esports. Yep. Interesting um, lineup for the attacking team. Wait, so is the attacker team um, Thirst Esport? Uh, let me check. Yes, it is. Yeah, it's quite an interesting lineup there. Running Astra, Astra, Killjoy, and KO. Uh, we haven't seen any uh, Astra plays so far in the past matches. Yep. So it's, it's going to be an interesting match. Yep, definitely. So basically, if uh, they're in the final match, one of them would be first and another would be second. So both of them are guaranteed to win a portion of the cash prizes that we provide. Third place. Thirty seconds left. Yes, Soroski from uh, YouTube. This is the final match. One enemy remaining. Recalling my boss. Oh, one shot. Damn. Nice. Out of Dory gets the triple kill. And that's the first match to Team I Love. Congrats. Let's take a look at the third place match. And Find the weak the point and break it. Upper Star Academy. Actually, it's, uh, yeah, they're defending. And Team Vanity is attacking. Down A. Yeah, that's the unfortunate. Yeah, that's that would be sad. Cover going out. Attacking at least the curing B side for now. Yeah, 
So like Jet and uh, Brim is still stuck One in here. Enemy remaining. Is uh, yep. Jet gonna get killed? No, oh, Reyna is gonna get killed. Yeah. Uh, Brim is trying to be close up in heaven. Oh, Reyna See, Brim dead. gets the kill, trades the Jet. Thrifty! Yeah. Sky got the final kill. Yeah, they can get positioning. And the problem is, it's kind of hard for them to come back, actually. Now, let's hop into the Champions match. Take a look at it. And it's uh, currently 1 uh, versus 1. But even for Team Isla versus Thirst uh, Esports. Uh, with Thirst Esports as attacking. They are currently up. Uh, no, they are currently even with two v two. Thirty seconds left. One enemy remaining. Okay, it's a two v one situation right now. Hmm. They actually managed to one. Yeah. Do, do they get any point for planting the bomb down? Like maybe yeah, yeah, extra, they, uh, they get the uh, yeah, extra point ah, for their ultimate. Mm. That's nice. What if it got defuse? Uh, does that count or no? Yep, if you defuse, you'll also get the point. Ah, I see. Looks like they're stacking B side right now. Kills are old um, backside, trying mm. to uh, try to slow down the uh, rush of uh, Team I Love. I mean, yeah. Yep. Apparently, it failed, and yeah. Yeah, for the ones uh, viewing from YouTube or Facebook, sh please share your uh, predictions that who you think would be winning for the champions and also for the third place. Drop your predictions in the comment section right now. One tap from Hollux. Currently, the Tuesday spot is in the lead with 3 2 2. That's uh, not really that far. And Team Ilo can come back anytime and regain the lead. 
So in the meantime, let's hop into the third place match. See what they are up to. Oh, it's currently five to one with uh, Team Vanity in the lead right now. Yep. Hmm, let's see if this dinner pays off. Get the, oh, he can't. Yeah, that's a nice double kill right there. Last player standing. It's currently a 1v3 situation going on. 1v2, can you clutch it? One enemy oh. remaining. 30 seconds left. Oh, that oh, that's very close. Well done. Yeah, he managed to get it down to 1v1. And unfortunately, uh, he can't finish it. And Char got the last kill of the match. Hmm. Team Vanity is still in the lead with 6 to 1 and pulling away. Can team can uh can Upper Star Academy come back with it? Or does the dinner cost them this match? Smoke down. Planted. Taken out. I've got your trail. Oh. Here we go. Oh, it's so far it's one six. Yep. Seems like Team Vanity is losing quite badly here. Wait, I think Team Vanity is winning. Yeah, Team Vanity is winning. Back. Oh yeah, Team Vanity is winning. Yeah, Upper Star Academy uh, dinner doesn't really reward them that well, I would say, in this case. Yeah, so in the meantime, let's hop back right into the Champions match. Which is actually quite close with uh, Team I Love leading with a 5 score and Tiz Esport just right be uh, behind them with a score of 3 currently. Turret out. Watch and learn. Divided. Blinded. Let's head over to um Forest's stream. Spike down. Hey. <laughs> Got him. 
Wait, actually. Uh. Standing ahead. One enemy oh. remaining. Me, my love, managed to came up on top. Right here. Standing ahead. The team I lose is currently in the lead. So we can the situation right now. We can see spot grouping rotating into the A site. Spike down A. Just oh. right now. Right here. Right here. Right here. Trying to wall bang it. One enemy remaining. They're trying to very best to defuse it right now. And it's a victory for Team I Love as they have plenty of time to defuse the bomb. It's a close match. Let's uh, let's let's view um, um upper star versus uh, team vanity real quick, shall we? Yep. Ooh, it's not looking too good for upper star academy. That's thirty only seconds eight left. One. But yeah, they're doing good in this round currently. Only Lulu left and Lulu has to ace to secure this round for them. He's got she's got one kill. And she gets another. No. Coconut seals the deal for Team Upper Star Academy. As Team Vanity tries to pull away with the Commanding you. It's a weird strat for Upper Star Academy. They are actually pushing, not uh, defending the side at all. You can see the coconut rotating to the side. Will not kill my ally. Two v three situation. A two v three situation. We have Napo coming back, supporting and. Team Manatee yeah. stacking B side right now. Lulu wants, and Coconut actually got the kill against Lulu. And can she hold it? But it has been planted, and Knuckles is coming back around. Coconut gets killed. It's a 1v2 situation. Can Knuckles clutch this out? Gets a grenade. Doesn't hit. Another one. Doesn't hit. Blinded. Narco is going to be grinded, walking into the trap. Both corners are Player standing. 1v1, and Narco get the clutch, actually, and secures the win for Team Upstar Academy. Yes. Well done. That's a very nice play when it, when it comes down to 1v3, and he actually got Last round before the switch. 
this is the last round before the switch and maybe after the switch upper star Beautiful. academy would have a chance at winning thanks taking the lead Humanity is stacking a side. Coconut gets the up shot. Oof. All five of the players have their ults. Um, we'll just see how they're going to use it. Yeah. It seems like um, the Tiger team are stacking uh, a side while well, the Omen is lurking. Yeah. Upper Star Academy is still holding on quite well in terms of uh, numbers. And it's a 3v3 three three situation right now with Team Vanity pushing in on A side. Marcos will titting back to A side. Blinding. Cover going now. One enemy remaining. Last player three situation. Now, of course, can he clutch that out? After Hunter! I'm with planting currently. 30 seconds left. So to get this fight down and survive long enough so that we get blown off. It's possible. Let's see if Narcos can clutch both rounds back to back. The team vanity and they're switching sides. Let's come back later and see if Upper Star Academy can have a better, better lead in the attacking role. Back to the first place match. Last player standing. Team I Love versus uh, Team What uh, and I love seems to have the commanding lead right now with a 10 to 4 score. Because he's bought not doing really well in the finals. And they have already switched sides in terms of. <clears throat> There's timeouts? Looks like uh, Tursi Sport has called on a timeout. Let's see. Um... <laughs> What they would come up with, maybe some uh, new strategies or anything. Um, In the meantime, let's get back to the uh, fifth place match where oh, uh, Upper Star Academy actually got one round back, and it's going to be nine to four. I think that's a very quick round because we just left and they ended it uh, immediately. Seems like uh, Upstar Academy is stacking A side right now with uh, two team manager players uh, wandering around B side. If they can pull this off, it will be a 5v3. Then that's a gamble for sure. Go so really well. Yep, it's a 3 3 4 situation right now. Now, one player. Both of the team two players are rotating back. Help to secure the base. Spike down A. One enemy remaining. Not really looking good. Can Chersia clutch this out? against three players uh. that's a uh, three missed shot and no she can't uh, susan got the last kill for that it's currently 10 uh against four with team vanity way ahead of Upper Star Academy in this third place match. 
And while the timeout is gone, let's hop back and into the first place match with Team I Love against uh, Terce Esport, which uh, they actually have a commanding lead of ten versus five, uh, ten versus four. Sorry, on the four board currently. Thirty seconds left. That's a flawless round from Team Tourist Esports. Well done, and they're catching up on the score and hopefully tired to get back in the game. Team Vanity has uh, proven to be able to uh, come back. So let's see if... Oh, Tourist Esports, I'm sorry. Uh, Tourist Esports has proven to be able to come back in previous rounds. So let's see if they can do it as well. It seems like this round, uh, none of the players have their outs, and we'll see how this pans out. Apparently, uh, Team I Love is stacking A side. Let's see if their strategy pans up nicely. As there are only two people guarding A side from Team e Tursi Sports. They're rotating into mid right now. Interestingly enough, um, Team I Love is still dominating, even though yep. they're attacking. I was, uh, you know, I was, I was uh, expecting uh, quite a struggle for them to attack, since they mm -hmm. only have a Jet as their uh, entry, and the rest is pretty, pretty much support. Um, but yeah, Hookerstar is still um, struggling to uh, to balance their fights. Uh, it's Thirst Esport actually. Oh, Thirst Esport, yeah, okay. Oh, that was clean. Yeah. No, they're just trying to find the Isle of Dory. Okay. Hmm. Can she? But I don't think she would be. She would have the time to plant. Yeah. Let's try for Isle of Glory. And Tersi Sports got another round in the back again. They're closing in on the gap and trying to tie the score. Hopefully, win this tournament. Well, team I love have Dory as a top frag with 21 kills. Get out of my way. Let's hop into a different point of view. From the same match. It seems like Team I Love is uh, always going for the stacking strat, and there are five play five players of the team are always uh, grouping together and attacking one side at the time. So that's a quite interesting strategy and that might be why they are winning so much maybe they are uh, attacking is very solid oh what the oh, wow. I think that's really good so far trying to get the ace and he got a triple yeah. kill with the dart damn okay damn. and he gets the ace he gets the he gets ace. ace yeah congrats that's a really nice uh a nice achievement in uh, trying to even up the score. Amazing play by IMP Skullman. Hmm. In terms of KDA, um, standing ahead. I think uh, the enemy jet, uh, Isle of Eco, is actually uh, dominating with a 20 bomb. Uh, 21 actually, 21 kills. Take flight. 
I see. Oh, it seems like Team Vanity has uh, won the match, actually. I need to clean them in! Include like uh, Apostar Academy and uh, charge from their dinner and third place match. So congrats to Humanity in getting third place in the whole tournament. While well, we have Team I Love uh, securing another round for the team in closing in to the uh, Closing in and getting the champion title of this tournament. Find the weak point and break it. Playing quite slowly this time. Yeah, they're not doing their typical rush uh, lesson learned from the previous round that they uh, enemy so actually got a triple kill. I think that, yeah. that quite uh, that threw them off a bit. Yeah. Killjoy ults. Uh, I wonder if the enemy Killjoy is gonna counter ult, but I don't think she's gonna do that as she's still quite far away. Um, Sky just ults uh, to get uh, more info of where the enemy is. Mm. Uh, let's see if enemy killjoy is going to ult. I think this is the perfect time as left. it would pressure them to either plant or just uh, stay alive. Yeah. But I think she's holding out her ult because Brim has ult. So if she ults, then it would just be cancelled out. Ah, I see. Yeah, because the Brim ult is uh, airstrike and basically the ult can destroy the killjoy's ult. Oh, she just ulted. Oh, it just got destroyed. Um, yeah, that must be useless. Yeah. Oh, that's and the round goes to I love. Well played in this round. Yeah, apparently, uh, they have adapted to. Yeah, they've learned from their past mistake and not rushing immediately and actually patiently waiting out. Yep. Trying to single out uh all incoming enemies from team. Uh, to this esports and yeah it's currently the match point for team i love if they can right. get it in the back right here. team uh to this esports is trying their best to secure it and Yeah, team I love has not picked up their spike yet. Uh, hmm. Interesting. <laughs> team I love is slowly moving to A side as. Sora gets the first kill against Isle of Rex. Uh, Isle of Dory as well, but Isle of Eco trades it by killing Killjoy. Now it's a 3v2 situation. I wonder if uh, Team Isle of will be able to clutch this. But they actually both have uh, ultimates. Oh, the, the Sova just died. And lastly, Isle of Eco gets killed by AFD's Coleman with a shock dart from a yeah. mile away. And this round goes to. Um, Esports, yeah. Yeah, apparently, uh, Tus Esports still needs uh, at least four consecutive rounds to get a chance in uh, winning. So, yeah, uh, definitely a lot of pressure on their shoulders currently. Well, uh, 
Well, Team I Love only needs uh, one more round to secure the win. So it's uh, definitely... Let's get this done. They're trying to get this done as quickly as possible as well. So yeah, they're always stacking at least, uh, at least four members on one on either side. And that's a nice uh, sloth picture I noticed on the wall. Yeah. Oh yeah, I just realized. Blocking <laughs> view. Oh, it like oh, seems they're like they're gonna side. just rush B side. <laughs> yep. Jet has already gotten to switch. Jet is side now. Right? He's going back to stairs, and uh, it seems like the rest of the team is quite slowly pushing in. Um, yep. That's you know the viewpoint of the. Uh, the attacking team here. It's not looking oh, it good for like, uh, Tosi Spot. 4v2. Yep, it's not looking good for Tosi Spot. This Can is the last out? chance. The spike has been planted. I don't think they would be able to um, clutch it. As well, as you can see, it's actually going mid now. Uh, yeah. Nah. That's this yeah. uh, end game. That was interesting. Yeah. That was the Good. end for this tournament, and yeah, congratulations uh, to Team I Love for clutching out uh, the win all the way to the finals and winning that and sealing the deal with a score of 13 versus 8 against Turs Esport. In the meantime, congrats to Turs Esport as well for uh, winning the second place in this 48 team tournament. Yeah, you guys did well as well. So both teams are actually uh, very highly skilled players and the score turned out to be not so one-sided. I would say it's uh, 13 to 8. Uh, it's quite close. And in terms of uh, the third place match, we have Team Vanity in the third place against uh, Upper Star Academy with only four score, uh, with scoring with only four rounds. So that's uh, pretty one-sided for Team Vanity securing the for sec for for securing the win, yeah, for Team Vanity, and that concludes uh, all of our matches. And congratulations to all of the winning teams. Uh, there's Team I Love for the champion, uh, Tours Esports as uh, second place, and Team Vanity as third place. And yeah. And now moving on to our uh, most anticipated, uh, I would say the most anticipated for the viewers as they get a chance to win one of, uh, uh, I would say 10% of the current prize pool that we have, which is a 50 ringgit lucky draw giveaway. And I hope everyone in the comment section, uh, I would say good luck and have fun. Let's see if you have the luck to win. Uh, this uh, lucky draw so in the count of three two one we will be picking the winner and let's spin that wheel shall we uh megan let's spin that wheel nice and we're spinning who would be receiving the 50 ringgit and it's Alvin. Are you here, Alvin? Please type in the YouTube chat if you're here. Is Alvin here? I don't think Alvin is here. Please type in chat if you're here. And be sure to PM uh, our Instagram page. ASAP and you only get two minutes if we do not receive your message uh, we'll be moving on and choosing another uh, another winner so you only get two minutes and the clock is ticking it's currently uh, one minute and 30 seconds left
and others don't uh, go away soon because uh, the winner might not be present. So yeah, definitely stay tuned. You get a chance to win as well if uh, Alvin doesn't show up in time. There's currently uh, one minute left. Calling once, calling twice, Alvin. You've just won 50 ringgit. Do you want to come and collect it? You have uh, 20 seconds left. All right. Calling once, calling twice, and we'll move on to the next one. Let's spin that wheel, shall we? And who would be the lucky winner? Dreaming Sushi, are you present in... Are you present in the... We have the second winner, Dreaming Sushi. Uh, I hope sushi is my dinner for tonight, yeah. Is Dreaming Sushi present? Please PM our Instagram page or you can just comment in our YouTube and, or the Facebook. Dreaming Sushi present. If you are present, please PM our Instagram page right away. You have two minutes before we move on to uh, another uh, another winner. Dreaming Sushi, please PM our IG page right now. It is uh, Awakening ORG if you're here. Or you can just comment down in the YouTube or Facebook comment section. All right, calling once, calling twice, and we'll move on to the next one. Yes, uh, you you will need to be present to win this giveaway because we want to reward the viewers that stayed until the very end, supporting all of the teams with the results. Next, we have uh, Melissa Wong. Is uh, Melissa Wong present? If you're present, please PM our IG page right away and com or you can just comment in YouTube and Facebook to receive this 50 ringgit giveaway. Uh, please comment down below or you can go to uh, Facebook or YouTube, either platform that you're watching from, or you can just PM our Instagram page right away to collect your 50 ringgit giveaway. And you have 10 more seconds before we move on to another winner. Oh yeah, I need to uh, take account that the stream is on a delay. So uh, I'll give 20 more seconds. So is uh, Melissa Wong present? Please comment in the YouTube or Facebook comment section, or you can just PM uh, our Instagram page. Oh, I forgot to type in the uh, winner's name. So, uh, present. Yeah. For others, uh, please stay tuned if the winner is, doesn't show up in the next 10 seconds. Oh, uh, yeah, can the mods confirm? Uh, am I seeing it? Are you guys seeing it? Uh, I think Melissa Wong is here. Yes, uh, congrats on winning 50 ringgit. Can you confirm? Uh, we need to confirm your Instagram handle as well. Please uh, directly message it 
us on the Instagram page to collect your 50 ringgit. Please respond to our message in Instagram to receive the 50 ringgit uh, price if uh, this is the true Melissa Wong that entered uh, our Yes, I've re just received the confirmation from uh, Melissa Wong and Instagram. Congratulations and winning the 50 ringgit uh, lucky draw. And thank you all of the viewers for joining in in this delightful evening. And yes, uh, unfortunately for the rest of you, you did not want, you did not win the 50 ringgit. And I'll see you in the next time. So thank you all for tuning in and uh, I'll just repeat one more time for the champion of our tournament. It is actually Team I Love. So a big congratulations to them. And the second place runner up, which is uh, Tears Esport. Also congratulations to them. They fought a hard fought battle with a score of 13 to 8. They just lost uh, merely five rounds to Team I Love. And they ended up in the second place winning 125 ringgit. And the first place winning... Uh, one uh 250 ringgit and congratulations to third place winner team vanity as well for winning 75 ringgit for their team so the champions get a total of 250 the second place gets uh, 125 and third place gets uh 75 ringgit cash prizes we will contact you shortly for the uh the payment receiving method and as well as melissa wong our lucky draw winner of a 50 ringgit out of our 500 ringgit prize pool so congratulations and we'll see you again uh in the next event so thanks for the great evening thanks for the commentary lufan as well thanks for having you by my side and that was a interesting night i would say no worries, no. yep so uh, i think we'll call it all for today and yeah, see you guys uh, on campus or if we have any chance in the future for any future events, definitely. So that's all from uh, our Awakening organization and good night. Bye, right, guys, and take care.